welcome back to my channel in this tutorial i'll be showing you the digital bokeh backgrounders effect on photoshop first create a photoshop document by clicking file and new i'm creating a large document for the background change the foreground color to gray i have the code for the color which is 262626 now go on edit fill and ensure you have selected foreground color when you press ok the foreground color will become gray change the foreground color back to black code is 000000 i'll create an ellipse shape select ellipse tool and draw it in the middle not too big or too small but it's up to you then disable the background layer by clicking on the eye icon right click on the ellipse layer select blending options here change the fill opacity to 50 percent then go on stroke to change the size to around 10 11 pixels Position it inside, ensure the fill color is black and click OK. I'm going to save this shape as the brush preset. Go to edit, brush preset. I'm going to name it Boca to remember what it is. You can name it anything. Click OK and the brush has been created. Then disable the ellipse layer and enable the background layer by clicking the eye icons. Create a new layer while it's selected on the background layer. If the foreground color isn't black, please select black. Then go on edit and fill it in black as we did before. Then right click on layer 1, blend in options and put fill opacity to 0% and this creates a nice effect. Click on gradient overlay to change the blend mode to overlay and on gradient select spectrum. You can modify and customize the colors to your choice but I am going to leave it as it is. Click OK. You can reverse it but keep the style as linear. Also I am going to make the angle 45 degrees. This is done. So click OK. Moving on select the background layer to create a group folder by pressing Ctrl and G on the keyboard or simply Click the create a new group icon that has been created. I'm going to change the layer blend mode of that to color dodge. Create a new layer under group 1 by clicking create a new layer. Select the brush tool and choose the bokeh effect brush we created earlier. I'm gonna click on window brush. Brush tip shape, I want to change the size to 500 and the spacing to 100%. After that, go on shape dynamics, change the size zeta to 100%, minimum diameter to 50%. On scattering, enter 1000 for both axes. I'll set the count to 5 and count zeta to 1. When that's done, on transfer set the opacity zeta to 50% flow zeta to 50% too and make sure control is on pen pressure then close it now make the foreground color white and you can start drawing with the brush when I'm done click the filter blur and Gaussian blur 
and I want to change the radius to 20 pixels create a new layer and change the brush size I'm going to reduce it to 300 and start drawing with the brush you can do it however you want to make it look nice again apply Gaussian blur and this time I'll set the radius to 5 or 4 pixels repeat this again by creating a new layer reducing the brush size and changing the Gaussian blur I'll put it to one pixel now create another layer and repeat this and that is how I create a bokeh effect you can now save it as a JPEG format and there you have it I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and learned from it please keep coming back to watch more of my tutorials and like comment subscribe and share bye